The Al Smite Prize is a, a recognition, a reward for excellence in human development, in education, in health and food security. And I'm very proud to be in the Board of Trustees of such an important undertaking for humankind. I'm here uh, as a, um, a member of the Board of Trustees of the Assamate Prize. Uh, this is a prize that targets three very fundamental uh, concerns of Africa in regards to its development. And to, for me, it is extremely important that I am here to, to work with other colleagues to make sure that this price gets the, the necessary support and um, encouragement that it would need for it to be a game changer for the way things are done in Africa. Because these three areas that has to do with education, has to do with food security, has to do with uh, health, without these three things, no country can develop, you can't do anything. So this is extremely important, and if it's done, and we hope it's going to succeed, it's going to be a big, big, big um, help for the continent. I'm Abdul Latif Al Hamad, Chairman of the Arab Fund for Economic and Social Development, which is located in Kuwait. It's a real privilege and a happy occasion to be celebrating the memory of a man, a great man who has helped many people in Africa. The poor people of Africa depended on him in many ways. It's the first board meeting for a Sumer Prize and I hope that the Sumer Prize will be an internationally recognized prize for international work in poor countries in Africa. We believe this prize not just the financial reward, but actually it will mobilize, in our view, uh, resources and interest and accelerate them to direct them at the topics of the prize. This year it's health. We hope that the winner will be someone or some institution that contributed a lot over the last few years to address the very important challenges in health, such as Ebola, malaria, such as the healthcare system in Africa. And I think if this prize uh, award to any of those or, or similar uh, well worthy recipient, it will trigger, no doubt in my view, additional resources, additional mobilization. Well, uh, Africa, as we have heard, that is uh, one of the largest continents and with the least uh, uh, importance in, in, in the sense of the world is not uh, looking at it with all the diseases and all the potentials that are not used there. That's where the ultimate will encourage people to uh, start uh, treating the, uh, the, uh, the African uh, or the Af Africa as, as Africa to, to improve itself by uh, agriculture, health, education, and many other potentials that are not uh, explored. Well, the Asumate Prize is a really good opportunity to really heighten the awareness around both some of the challenges that continents like Africa face, but, but also real opportunities to meet some of those challenges. It puts a spotlight on some heroes working on the front lines to really address some uh, issues on the front line, like food security or, uh, or trying to improve the health access for the world's poorest. The 2015 Al-Samate Prize for Health was a really good opportunity to get a sense of just how diverse and amazing some of the work that's happening out uh, in the field. Uh, there was a very diverse uh, array of submissions from 36 different countries. So it was a challenging selection process, but uh, one that was really rewarding to see the diversity of, of people working on the front lines to improve health access. Well, the 2016 uh, prize for food security was equally as challenging as the one awarded for health. Uh, in this case, we didn't have a clear winner. We had two really powerful submissions uh, and felt that those two organizations really were deserving of, of, uh, of sharing the prize this year.
دولة الكويت مركز للعمل الإنساني ومنح سيدي حضرة صاحب السمو الشيخ صباح الأحمد القادر الصباح عفوه الله ورعاه أن الكويت لقب قائد للعمل الإنساني دكتور عبد الرحمن السميط من التنمية الأفريقية موقرون سعادة الأخ الدكتور عدنان أحمد شهاب الدين مدير عام مؤسسة الكويت للتقدم العلمي مقرر الجائزة أخواتي والأخوان حبوب الكرام السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. يشرفني بداية أن أنقل إليكم تحيات سيدي حضرة صاحب السمو الشيخ صباح الأحمد الجابر الصباح حفظه الله